Okay, Assalamualaikum and salam sejahtera So before we start with the uh, answering about the articles The usage of a, an and the in your exercise Okay, let me introduce to you about the countable nouns and uncountable nouns Countable nouns, they are the names of separate objects, people and etc which we can count okay, something that we can count something uh, sesuatu yang kita boleh kira they have both singular and plural forms for example a or one book two books a or one man or two men okay they take singular or plural verb forms this banana is delicious these bananas are delicious so when something that can be counted then we have it's a, uh, it will be categorized under countable nouns for uncountable nouns they are the names of things we do not see as separate and which we cannot count tidak boleh dikira sesuatu yang tidak boleh dikira they have no plurals okay no plurals for example milk weather money they take only singular verbs the weather was very hot milk is good for you so not use with a and or one so dalam case ini uncountable nouns dia akan mengambil uh, singular verb sahaja okay maksudnya satu sahaja tunggal sahaja dia tidak ada banyak many berbanding dengan countable nouns they can take singular or plural Satunggal ataupun banyak okay, Itu pengetahuan sebuah sedikit Apakah dia countable nouns Dan uncountable nouns okay, Kata nama yang boleh dikira Dan tidak boleh dikira okay, Let's look for the articles A, N or the So these notes I get it from the my uh, reference books okay when i was at utm skudai so this there are two articles the indefinite article a or n and the definite article the okay let's look to the 4.1 a or n so the article a is used before countable nouns yeah, sesuatu yang boleh dikira beginning with consonant sound such as B, C, D, F and etc. Or in which the beginning H is sounded. For example, house, hatchet and so on. Maksudnya, kita gunakan perkataan E ini, artikel E ini, di permulaan huruf-huruf yang bermula huruf B dan sebagainya. Dan juga perkataan yang ada bunyi huruf H. House, hatchet, apa lagi? Uh, what else? Hide. Okay, so the article N is used before countable nouns beginning with the vowel sound of A, E, I, O, U when this U does not have a Y sound. Okay, maksudnya di sini apabila kita menggunakan perkataan-perkataan yang bermula dengan huruf A, E, I, O atau U maka kita gunakan uh, article N. So when this U does not have Y sound Dia ada perkataan U Tetapi tak ada Y Okay Maksudnya di sini uh, U U tu kalau kita bunyikan Okay Dia punya ejaan atau spelling dia is Y U Okay Y and U To, to pronounce Untuk bunyikan perkataan U tersebut Okay The spelling should be Y U So Without Y eh, Without U eh, Without Y So we cannot say it, we cannot pronounce it you. Maybe we can pronounce it am, um, and so on. So, uh, such as, for example, an umbrella, a university. Say. So, in this case, umbrella, the word you there, okay, we, 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 pronounce, uh, we don't pronounce it you. We pronounce it am. Okay, so tidak ada bunyi Y dekat situ. Okay. Same to the a university. A, a university. 
not university a uh, university okay there's no sound of y if a word begins with a silent h it is considered as beginning with o okay we use n with the word with, uh, with silent h maksudnya walau ada perkataan h tetapi tidak dibunyikan contohnya and honest men and our kita tak sebut and how and our seolah-olah so, kita buang h tersebut and honest men okey kita buangkan huruf h okey number 2 if there are a descriptive words before the noun then the article is placed before the descriptive words and follows the first letter of the first descriptive word A big umbrella, an ugly picture, an extraordinary clever child. Okay, so we use N after the A, E, I, O, U. Ugly start with U, say, so we just use an ugly picture. Extraordinarily, starting with E, then we use and for an extraordinarily clever child okay that's one uh, that the one is for a segment a a or a or n okay and then for b when to use a or n a or N are used in the sentence to mean general reference to single countable nouns. One, or any, or species, or kind. For examples, I bought a can of coke. Maksudnya di sini dia menunjukkan bahawa kita membeli satu tin air Coca-Cola. Sebagai contoh, a can of coke. Please get me a drink. Maksudnya di sini, a drink, so, maksudnya any drink. Uh, you can give me a coffee, you can give me a tea, you can give a milk, and so on. Okay, any drink, a drink. Uh, Zeppel is a drink, not an animal. Okay, is a drink. Maksudnya, a drink di sini adalah sejenis minuman. Not an animal. Maksudnya, merujuk kepada species tadi lah. Species or kind. Okay, we go to the, the usage of C. Using a and n in expressions. Sometimes we use a or n in expression that refer to more than one thing. Okay, kita rujuk kepada satu uh, ekspresi yang menunjukkan lebih daripada satu benda. For example, a few, a number, a large number, a little, <coughs> a lot of, a great many, uh, an enormous amount of. Okay, kita boleh guna perkataan a di situ. Okay, a few of birds. Okay, a large numbers of people, for examples. Without a or n, this expression have a different meaning. A few people came. Maksudnya sini, some did come. Few people came. Okay, less than the expected number came. Maksudnya sini, Jika kita letakkan a few, maksudnya ada yang hadir. Jika kita letak few people came, maksudnya uh, kurang orang yang hadir. Okay, so normally we use we can start with a large number of came or large numbers came. Okay, now let's look the usage of article the. Using the with nouns. The article can be used before any nouns. If there is an adjective before the noun, the comes before the adjective. We use the with the nouns when referring to the particular person, thing or quality. For example, the color of chalk, the beauty of the hills, the paw of the lion. Okay? Maksudnya kita cuba merujuk kepada sesuatu, seseorang, sesuatu ataupun kualiti kepada sesuatu. Okay, the Indians of Malaysia. Okay. A particular person. Okay, number two. 
when referring to previously mentioned things. We saw a lion at the circus. The animal looked sad. Uh, kita dah sebut pasal lion tadi, singa. Dan kita nak sebut lagi pasal uh, singa tersebut. Then we use the. The animal or the lion. Okay. Before, number three. Before objects of which there is only one. Ada satu-satu sahaja di dunia. For example, the Great Wall of China. The Mona Lisa. The Eiffel Tower. The Petronas Twin Tower and so on. Number four, before top post or positions, the prime minister, the president, the king, the principal. Okay, dia merujuk kepada jawatan-jawatan yang tinggi lah. Contohnya, Perdana Menteri, Pengetua. Okay, we cannot say the teacher. Okay, teacher is a lot. We have a lot of teachers there in, in, in our school. So, we can say the principal because only one principal in SMK Batu Empat. Number five, before... Super Latif okay, The best The tallest The most difficult Okay Number six Before comparative He is the taller Of the two Okay Untuk buat perbandingan Then kita guna kata, uh, Artikel The He is the taller Which the better Okay However When we mention Both items being compared The the is not used. Bila kita membandingkan antara dua orang atau dua item, kita tidak menggunakan the di sini. He is taller than Ricky. Kita, kita kita tak boleh sebut he is the taller than Ricky. Sebab kita membandingkan antara dua orang di sini. Okay, number seven. Before ordinals. Ordinals mean the position, kedudukan. The first child, the second day, the third person, and so on. Number eight. In certain expression of times In the 1920s In the evening okay, Bila kita nyatakan pada satu-satu masa Kita gunakan artikel the In the evening, in the morning okay, At the beginning okay, number, number nine When referring to public places and amenities okay, When the listener or reader is aware of which one we are referring to I'm going to the police station In Greek Okay So There are only one police station in Greek Okay The police station I'm going to the Petronas In Greek Only one Petronas in the Greek Okay The theater The railway station The bus station And so on But when the listener reader Or reader does not know Which one we are referring to Drop the the And replace with a or n Okay For example I'm going to the I'm going to a toilet Which toilet? Okay, we have a lot of toilet in this school, for example. Which toilet? Block A, block B, block C, and so on. Number 10. To turn adjectives into nouns when referring to categories of people. Okay. Bila kita nak merujuk kepada satu-satu kumpulan manusia. Ataupun kumpulan manusia lah di sini. For example, a home for the blind. Okay, a home for the blind. The blind mean untuk orang-orang buta. Okay, <coughs> the deaf, the lame, the aged. Should the rich feed the hungry? Should the rich? Se- adakah sepatutnya orang kaya? Rich tu merujuk kepada golongan kaya. So the rich mean merujuk kepada orang orang yang kaya. To refer to a race in general, we use the Chinese. Okay, the Sabahan. Okay, orang-orang Sabah So, the Sabahan The Malay Okay The Chinese And so on However, to refer to only some members of race We do not use the Okay, there are Chinese living all over the world Okay, our firm employs Japanese Number 11 After many A few One of Indicating A portion of a larger amount Many of the ladies A few of the cars One of the reasons Okay After many After a few After one Of We use the One of the reasons A few of the cars Many of the ladies Number 
when referring to someone something as a type or representing a specific group the lion the largest mammals the sita the anklung so the lion maksudnya merujuk kepada kategori ataupun kumpulan singa the largest mammal merujuk kepada kumpulan uh, kumpulan mamalia okay the whale merujuk kepada semua ikan-ikan paus yang ada di dunia so the whale however when referring to one or more items not as a, as a category the article or a and n or a number is used we bought a piano contohnya saya beli sebuah piano so a piano lah okay they had four violins they had They have a blue proton vera and two proton sagas. Okay, the usage of the for B, the with the with names. Okay, the names of some countries and most seas, rivers and mountain range begin with the. Semua nama-nama negara bermula dengan perkataan the. The Malaysia, the United States, the America, the Republic of Korea and so on. Semua nama-nama uh, Laut juga menggunakan perkataan the The Indian Oceans The Black Sea The Hindi Sea uh, The English Channel The Strait of Malacca Malacca And so on Okay Same to the All Rivers too The Amazon okay, The Darling The Mekong Mountain Range The Alps The Gunung Kinabalu Okay Because the only one With the Gunung Kinabalu Okay The Banjaran Titiwangsa Okay Sea The with names of buildings Before certain buildings or structures Which are unique or important ya, Kita dah sebut tadi okay? The Petronas Twin Tower The Eiffel Tower The Menara of Giza Gaza, Giza and so on And then uh, we use the before hotels The name of the hotels The name of the cinema okay? The region The Greek hotel Uh, the Banding Resort, for examples. Okay, D. D with the names of organizations. Okay, before ministries. B, uh, contohnya kita nak sebut pasal kementerian. Okay, the Ministry of Defense. The Ministry of Education. Before government and departments. The Education Department. The Road Transport Department. Okay, uh, kita gunakan D. Before organizations. The Armed Forces. Okay, the Football Association. Organisasi juga kita gunakan kataan the. E the before certain special events and period of times. Okay, contohnya before special events, the Olympic Games, the World Cup, okay, Piala Dunia, okay, satu-satunya events yang ada. So the World Cup. So before periods of time, okay, the 15th, uh, the 15th century, for example. Before names of the examinations. The UPSR The PT3 Okay And so on F When the is Not in use For examples We do not use the In countries With one word names For examples China Malaysia Okay Maksudnya sini kita tidak sebutkan negara itu Dalam satu perkataan Okay uh, Kita hanya sebut perkataan saja Malaysia So We don't have to use The article the Towns Kuala Lumpur Washington Beijing okay. Tetapi jika Ada perkataan uh, Selain daripada uh, Kuala Lumpur Contohnya Kuala Lumpur Is the Capital City Of Malaysia Okay So we not uh, We do not use the here Lakes Lake Toba Mountains The Mount Kinabalu We do not use the here Buildings Road Days Number 8 Certain main festivals Christmas Hari Raya Okay Meals Breakfast, lunch, dinner Thanks for the wonderful dinner 10 Names of people We do not use article the We cannot say the Dr. Mahade We just Use Dr. Mahade Brand, company and business name Toyota, Motorola, Malaysian So you do not use the here When initials are pronounced as a word AMNO 
uh, Mars, ASEAN and so on When referring to the initial of businesses RTM, KTM, okay Transportation by bus, by taxi, car, plane, etc Names of shopping places not ending with the word shop or market Okay, lot 10 Jaya Jasko So all the names we cannot use the in front of it Okay, that's all for the use of the Okay, this is the answer for exercise for article A or N Okay, so I will not elaborate or I will not explain about the usage of a or n in this article in this uh, exercise because you already know uh, the usage of a or n okay it's very obvious n is used when with vowels a e i o u while the other uh, consonants okay we have to use the article a Okay, let's look to the next exercise by the usage of the. So I will emphasize about some of the words that do not use the article the here. Okay, for example, number eight. Would you like some tea? Okay, we not without the use of the article the because tea is referred to the. Uh, that a meal okay a meal okay we have lunch we have breakfast we have dinner and tea is a one of the meal time there salah satu masa untuk minum minum petang okay so would you like some tea number nine julie and christine are cousins okay we do not use the here because cousins is a kind or a species or not a species a kind of a types of relationship Okay, a type of relationship. And then, number 11. Mrs. Linz returned to Scotland. So, we do not use the here because Scotland is the name of the country. Okay, it's not an island. It's not a united. It's not a republic like Korea and so on. So, we do not use the there. Number 13. I usually eat fish and chips for lunch okay we not use the fish because fish and chips is the category of meals or category of uh, foods fish and chips for lunch lunch also we do not use the there because lunch is the meal time masa makan masa makan tengah hari masa makan pagi dan sebagainya children it's time to go to bed okay so without use the a uh, or without use the article the there because it shows the time to sleep. Go to bed. Number 18. It was quite late. So, we hurried home. Okay. Sudah lewat dan kami bergegas pulang. So, we not use the word the there. Number 19. My mother went to school to see my tutor. Okay. Went to school. Not to a school. But not to the school. But to school. School is the name of places in general to see my tutor. Okay, number 20. We had breakfast in garden. Okay. Once more, we still use the breakfast refer to the meal time. Masa makan, masa sarapan. So, we do not use the there. We had breakfast in garden. In the garden. Okay, next look for the next exercise. Either we have to use the or a or n or no article at all number one did you come by air no i come by sea okay so in this case air is referred to the types of transportation so you not you uh, we do not use any article there my brothers goes to church in the morning okay in the afternoon, he meets friends. So, church is the places. So, we do not use any article. In the morning. Morning is the certain uh, expression of times. Morning, evening, 
afternoon so we have to use the in the afternoon in the morning okay he meets friends not a friend because many there so it's a plural so we cannot use the because we did not mention it earlier so we have to use friends we meet friends in general kita berjumpa kawan okay secara umum berjumpa kawan secara umum my neighbor got bronchitis so bronchitis is is, is a a type of a disease not a disease a type of a, a this is a, a type of ill bronchitis so we not use any article there was taken to hospital or maybe we can use the hospital because it refers to the the hospital the only hospital in greek for example it's a pleasure to do a business with such an efficient organizations okay yeah so to yeah a pleasure so to yeah menarik okay to do a business so, uh, untuk menjalankan sesuatu perniagaan hubungan perniagaan research and efficient organization dengan satu syarikat yang efektif yang yang berkesan okey number 5 linda live on the ground floor of an of an old house okey live on the ground floor Okay, the is referred to the ground floor. Okay, the 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 name of the floor of an old house. So this story, this is a story about an Englishman, so orang orang Inggris, an Irish, so an Irish, and and a Scotsman. Okay, so you have to use an, an a. Uh, depends on the vowels there. Number seven. My aunt very often has coal and coal meat and salad for supper in summer. So coal meat and salad refers to the types of food. So you have to use. You don't have to use any article there. Number eight. She hates living on the top floor. The top floor means first one of the uh, floor. Okay, in the block of the block of the blocks of flats. So that's all for the answer for this question. So you can see the details, okay? Uh, that I will submit to you. I will post to you in the Telegram. Thank you.